This is your eye. If you're the one. And this but is your like eyebrow. You. The area colored tan yeah, is called your brow bone. It is usually colored white, cream, or a color lighter than your skin tone. The darkish red area is your crease. It is usually a dark color. If you have a bigger eye area between your brow and eye, you may want to make your crease thicker. Generally, the part between your brow bone and the crease gets blended together so there is no harsh lines. The gray area below the crease is called your eyelid. Sometimes, you can divide the lid into halves, coloring the first and second halves different colors. You can even divide the lids into thirds, again using different colors for each section. For that matter, you can divide the lid into as many different sections as you want, using as many colors as you'd like. For now, let's just stick to this area as the lid area. The area labeled with gray is called your inner corner. It is usually colored with a white or light color to make your eyes stand out. The black lines near your lashes are called your lash lines. There are different techniques you can do that can give you different looks, but we'll get to this later. Next are your water lines. They're labeled gray. It looks like your lash line, but is a wet area of your eye. A pencil liner is most effective in this area because of the wet surface. Using a liquid liner will cause it bleed into your eye. Finally is your outer V area. This is labeled in black with thin the crease and lid area. This is usually a dark color blended out to add definition.